Hi buddies and curls, we are back with another video. In today's video, we are going to be talking about the InStyler Blue Dryer Turbo Onic Blow Dryer and also how I blow dry my hair and get some stretch and volume on first day hair. Now, I washed my hair last night and it wasn't completely dry. So in the video, I'm going to show you what I do and kind of like the specs on this blow dryer. I think gr great hair is about the tools that you use and the products in order to obtain the result that you desire. So I just want to show you my favorite blow dryer. I've had some blow dryers in the past. I really do like my Revlon. I think I've used that in a couple of videos, but this is a step up. I did get this from Beautycon and I just like InStyler products in general you know to straighten my hair I use it in styler I have not done that on camera give this video a thumbs up and comment down below and let me know if you want me to show you how I straighten my natural hair using the in styler but this is the blow dryer that I use to get volume today and it's important because it's lightweight and it also uh, has a diffuser on here so I can take the concentration nozzle off and I can put on the diffuser. Now, I didn't know what a diffuser was back in the day. I thought it was for other ethnicities, okay? But this is amazing for curly hair. What it does is it isolates the air and so it doesn't blow everywhere. So your curls stay intact. It allows you to actually put it close to the root and dry the root, dry the end, however you would like. But I love a diffuser. I feel like a diffuser is a must-have for a curly girl for natural hair. And um, for keeping your, your curls intact. Especially if you're like me where it's very easy to get frizz. You want a, a, a diffuser. I really do love this uh, blow dryer. It has a 9-inch cord. Which I love because it doesn't. It's thick. It's a thick cord. So it doesn't like ravel up, you know. And I really just like the power that I get from this. I definitely can tell. Let's get started in blow drying my hair and getting some volume. It has a high power motor. It has a turbine fan, a tourmaline ceramic uh, technology with this blow dryer. Turbo ionic switch, which I really like because I've never seen it before where you can choose the ions, whether it's turbo or if it's low. So. I could actually take this and instead of having a switch, I can decide how high I want or low. And all I have to do is roll if I want it low and then I can switch it and I can go high and low and high and low. It has two heat settings and it has a cool shot, which is this is a cool shot. If you want your curls to really be intact and really not get frizzy at all you want to hit, hit this while you're blowing your hair which is that cool set, setting it locks in the style and closes the hair shaft so this is going to be really good for hair uh for high porosity hair because you know how our hair wants to open all the time if you want to close the hair shaft you hit the this button and you just blow dry this is ideal also for relaxed hair i would say because Closing the hair shaft is what's going to actually close and make the hair follicles smoother and it's also going to cause that shine to go through, so come through. So I, I highly recommend, I, I use my cool power button before. I didn't know what that was, but I'm glad that explained it here a little bit better. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video of how I blow dry my hair to attain volume and how I stretch it a little bit. Like I said, this is first aid hair. Most of the time my hair is very flat, especially when you use a gel. Like I said, I will list everything down below what I used in my hair. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It always lets me know what you guys love to see here on the channel. And I will see beautiful you in the next video.